David Torres. What's up, what's up? Let's give it up for Lou Perez. Obama, the man, the man. That's the man. We got a Puerto Rican in the Supreme fucking court. <laughs> Shit is fucking changing. It's time for a fucking change. Let's give it up for him. One thing I didn't like, um, Hillary was doing her thing. She was doing her thing, and a lot of men were saying, you know, Hillary's not strong enough. Hillary's too weak. All the men that said that. When you can push an eight-pound baby out of the tip of your fucking dick, and three days later, be in your girlfriend's house showing the baby off. Talk to me about being fucking tough. Yeah. You know? Talk to me about being tough. I know a friend of mine who had a fucking kidney stone, and he was fucking dying. He said, yo, what the fuck wrong with you? I got a stone. I got a fucking stone. I got pants for the motherfucker. I was like, yo, damn. He pissed that shit out, that little motherfucker. I said, that, you're fucking pissed and you're fucking crying? What the fuck? So then I said, damn, women go through shit. Women go through shit, so I give you women a fucking hand. You know? Us men, we gotta do a lot of shit to keep your women happy, you know? We gotta act like a thug at times. I used to be a thug, I gave that shit up because I hate fucking fighting. I'm a fucking coward. Fuck that shit, you know? I ain't gonna fucking get hit, I hate fucking pain. Fuck that shit, you know? I have one girl that she's like, you a thug? You a fucking thug? I'm like, yeah, yeah, I'm a fucking thug. You know, we were in the city hanging out and we was in the corner and somebody kept bumping into me and she looked at the person, you gonna do something? I'm like, Shit. yeah, you know? So I turned around and I hit that little bitch. And I told her, next time your fucking wheelchair hits me, bitch, I'ma give you a fucking flat. Fuck that, you know? Fuck that shit. I don't give a fuck. Wheelchair or not. She was bumping into me, you know? Shit. Went to a fucking club. There was a big fucking guy looking at her. She's like, you gonna let him do that? Damn. I don't wanna fucking fight this motherfucker's thing. You know? So then she said, go up to him and do something. So I was like, ah, fuck it. Went up to him. I looked at her, I gave her the L Cool J look. <laughs> so walked up to the motherfucker and said, I looked at her, looked at him, and I told him, you looking at me, Papi? <laughs> he said, no. I said, you sure, Papi? You're not looking at me? Then I looked at her again. He said, no. I said, you want my number, Papi? He said, no. He left. She came and she said, what happened? I said, I told that motherfucker I was going to fuck him up. <laughs> I was going to fuck him up. Don't fuck with me. I'm the fuck, fuck being a thug. I gave that shit up, you know? Can't be a thug. I got a fucking Yorkie. <laughs> fuck you going to be a thug for Yorkie? I have a friend of mine who's a thug all fucking in his hummy and everything like that. He got a fucking poodle. <laughs> fuck you going to be a fucking thug for poodle? What the fuck wrong with you? A fucking thug with a poodle? <laughs> Shit, you know? This world's gotta be changed. Like Obama said, time for a fucking change, you know? <laughs> I got a confession to make. I'm fucking hooked on infomercials. <laughs> I fucking bought the set and forget it. I believe in that shit. I left on vacation. Fucking fireman said it's just the same. Set it and forget it. I was like, yo, the motherfucking commercial didn't say that. It didn't say set and forget and come back. It said set and forget it. You know, but since I was a kid, I've been hooked on you know infomercials and shit. I had a next door neighbor, this little girl used to be in a wheelchair, you know. She used to sit next to me. I said, say, Susie, what's up? Her mother said she was paralyzed. I was like, oh, man, what does that mean? She said, she can't move. I was like, shit. That night, I went upstairs. I started watching TV. I saw a commercial. This lady came out. She was like, now I can run. Now I can jump. Now I can swim. I'm wearing tampons. I said, holy shit. I need some of this shit for fucking Susie. You know? I went, bought a pack of fucking tampons, you know? 
took Suzy to the YMCA. She was just sitting there. <laughs> Why y'all laughing at Suzy? I fucked up. <laughs> you know? I asked her, well, what the fuck you do for tampon? One of the guys that used to that shit up there for John. I'm like, oh shit, you know? So I took one out, I stuck it up Suzy, she moved. She went. <laughs> so I said, shit, it almost fucking worked, you know? She didn't move after that. So I said, man, you know, I got a toy that takes two batteries. So I stuck another one in her, she moved again. I said, Suzy, come on, baby, run, jump. Fucking Suzy just said. So I said, fuck it, you know what? I don't know how to fucking sweat. So I went to the locker and I shoved two of these motherfuckers up my ass. You know? Went out, I jumped in the fucking pool. They didn't know how to fucking swim. Now here I am fucking drowning. And I remember that the box didn't say that when tampons get wet, these motherfuckers grow to like 40 times its fucking size. So now my asshole is fucking growing. I'm fucking drowning with two strings hanging out my fucking ass. You know, and then they see Susie laughing. So fuck you, Susie. Fuck you in your wheelchair, you know? Fucking bitch. Fuck that. So I went and I left Susie in the fucking corner. I don't even know where the fuck I left her. But after that, I couldn't fucking swim or nothing like that. Yeah, so. We're still out there looking for fucking Bin Laden. All the fucking technology this fucking country has. And we can't find a fucking eight foot giant in the fucking desert. <laughs> you know, we got the eye in the sky. The eye in the sky, we see everything. Motherfucker, you don't see this motherfucker. You know, he comes out every fucking month and sends a video. Hello. <laughs> Hello. You know, where the fuck do you get electricity in the fucking desert? You're telling me you ain't got no fucking thing to read electricity in the desert? You know? You're, you're looking for this motherfucker and his men are on fucking cameras. What is it like? Shh, yo, there he goes. There he goes, all right. Follow him. Follow him right there. What's he doing? Oh, he's on his fucking camel! He's on the camel, guys! Forget it, forget it. Show, turn the jets off. He's on his camel. We can't follow the fucking camel, you know? <laughs> what the fuck is an eight foot fucking giant? You understand? Look for this motherfucker. He's out there. He's out there, you know? Bin Laden is getting away. That motherfucker. You know, you want to find him? Follow the motherfucker that brings the baby all the fucking time. You know? I know he ain't got a fucking Pony Express. Where the fuck is he getting this video? You no, know, but Lad ain't walking up like this. Yo, you get this video to You know? And no, you can't see him. You know, the guy's like, yo, Lad, what you got? You get this video to this Catch your ass. We're gonna get you out there, you know? I'm hooked on watching movies, these superhero movies. Yeah. Kinda pissed off with Superman Returns. How the fuck are you gonna fuck Lois Lane and have her be pissed at you because you left? You didn't super fuck her? How the fuck you? How is she gonna give you attitude? Psst, this motherfucker ain't paid me no child support in a couple of years. What the fuck? You're Superman! Supposed to take that bitch in the antro, laser dick there out your fucking dick! You know? You take her to space down a choke and then drop her ass and fuck her back up! You're fucking Superman! How you gonna let this bitch get away with that shit? You know? You fucking super, he pissed me off, Superman. You can't fuck nobody and just be cool about that shit. You know? One superhero I feel sorry for who always gets a one night stand is like the Incredible Hulk. You know, like, fuck me, Mr. Banner. Don't get me angry. <laughs> you wouldn't like me when I'm angry. Fuck me, Mr. Banner. <laughs> <laughs> Break that bitch in half. You know, Mr. Hogg. And then you can't talk about it. You can't say, yeah, I fucked that bitch. Where is she at? <laughs> and the bitch blew up, man. <laughs> what the fuck, you know? One superhero that feels sorry for is Flash. You know, he's in and out. You know, he's too fast, he's too fast, you know. 
you know, so before I let you guys go, I want to give you a thought. When y'all go outside, let me know if y'all ever seen a baby pigeon. No one ever seen a baby pigeon. No one, right, y'all? You live in New York, you always see those big motherfuckers. But you don't see baby pigeons. Remember that. Y'all have a good night. <laughs> Give it up for the motherfucker! Give it up for the motherfucker!